Hi everyone. So today, Hi. Don't do that, please. So today is a very exciting day, isn't it, Stu? Oh yeah. So my Christmas present from Mum and Dad was two pet dagoos, and I'm so excited. I've wanted dagoos for such a long time, and obviously all my nagging has paid off, right, Stu? Yeah. <laughs> so we are actually on our way to pick them up now. Dad reserved them for me. Uh, I, I had nothing. I had no idea this was going to happen. I was not expecting it at all. Um, I thought I'd never convince them. Um, but yeah, so we're on the way to get them now. And I thought I'd vlog it because it's a new pet and it's very exciting. Or two new pets. Um, so yeah, I will see you when we are with them. Hello, it's me. I can't be I have takers. They're both in here. I'm talking to the camera, Shu. They're going a bit mad on there. <laughs> I have got a carriage to put the boxes in because I have a feeling they're going to chew through these. Um, so we put them in there. Because <laughs> it's like, because we had to come all the way to Gloucester to get them because we couldn't find them anywhere else. So um, yeah, it's about 45 minutes back. So we're going to have to put them in a another carrier in these in case they chew through. <laughs> I just hope they don't chew through my carrier. <laughs> So I've actually been home with them for a while but I didn't want to film them because I just didn't want to like shove a camera in their face. Um, but I thought I'd show you their cage. They are in, they've been in for about an hour now so um, I figured now would be a good time to show you. So I haven't actually got all the stuff I've ordered for them um, so I will show you their cage again once I've got all the new stuff for them. Um, some of it's coming today, some of it's coming tomorrow so hopefully I get to show you all of that. But I, this is what their cage looks like so far. So it is very big for two of them. Um, there you go, now it's in focus. This is actually from Zoo Plus. Now it has actually got plastic trays. I know that they probably will chew it, so I'm going to find a way to cover them. Um, I'm going to do a lot of research and different types of bedding and stuff. Um, I'll start up here first. Like I said, it's pretty basic at the moment, just because we don't have that much stuff. Um, the doors are really good, they have a chain. So um, I think one of them is over here. So they are actually called Bert and Ernie. Um, I don't actually know which one's which yet because A, I haven't decided and B, they look exactly the same so I can't really tell them apart. But there's one of them. I think I'm scaring him a bit so. Um, we have a wheel there. It is very big. Um, I, ex I actually brought that like a year ago, well not, not a year ago, like six months ago probably. Because um, I brought it accidentally for the hamsters and I realised it was massive, it didn't fit in their cages. So um yeah, but we have a few little toys and stuff. This one doesn't really have anything on. I don't really have enough stuff yet, so... Um, yeah, I really like this cage, actually. It's really good. This is one of the boxes that they came in. They came in separate boxes in case they started fighting. And there is the other goo. You can't really see him, though. <laughs> um, so they are two boys, by the way, in case you didn't already get that. Um, I'll just open this one. I'm trying not to scare them, so I'm trying to be really quiet. Um, we have a treat ball here. This was the guinea pigs, but they never use it, so I decided to give it to these guys. I'm going to have to keep an eye on them with it, though, because if they start chewing it, it could be a bit dangerous, just because it is like a plasticky um, material. Um, then we just have a food ball, which just has some food, just some changeover food, which I got given, and then some vegetables, which this little cutie is going for. Um, I think this one may be Bert. I'm not... Or, uh, I don't know. It could be either Bert or Ernie. I'm not really sure. Um, oh, he's gonna, he's having a little adventure. So I've never had diggies before. Um, I have done a lot of research because I've been nagging mom and dad to let me get them for ages. Um, so I do know quite a lot about them. But yeah, this is their little nest box, which is also something I got for Christmas. And we have a hay rack. I'm not sure if they get stuck in that hay rack. I'm gonna have to keep an eye on them because um, it is quite wide. But, hello. Hi. <laughs> A bit scared. I haven't handled them yet because I'm giving them a chance to settle in. And um, we just have a water bottle. I've ordered them a different one just because this one came with a cage and it's really not very good. I have ordered them a different one. Um, that that ladder was a hamster one, but <laughs> he's demonstrating. Hello. You're very brave. I think this one is Bert actually because Bert is the more confident one, whereas Ernie is just frozen. <laughs> oh, that's so cute. Um, and this is actually a hemp mat. Um, my mum got me this to try, so we're going to see how that works out. <laughs> He's so cute. So a few of the things I ordered have arrived. I will show you the rest in a minute, but I just thought I quickly show you the ones I put in the cage. 
So the first thing is this tunnel. It is quite big for the two day goo, so it's like a guinea pig size one. Um, especially because they're babies, they're so small, but I thought it'd be fine. Um, and hopefully they like destroying it. I've also put in this ladder, which we already had for the hamsters. But the hamsters don't really find it that interesting, I don't think. Um, and I can always take it out anyway and give it back to the hamsters, it doesn't really matter, so... Yeah, um, that's the original bendy bridge. I also have a second, like, medium-sized bendy bridge. Um, and then, just have a few little toys. Added a toilet roll tube. <laughs> um, so, yeah, just have a few bits and bobs. Um, they're actually both downstairs at the moment. But it's so confident. Um, I don't know where Ernie is, actually. I think Ernie might be in the nesting box. I also got from Amazon this metal sand bath. This is just the rosewood um, options one. I also got this thing. I didn't get into it. Oh, this was from Amazon, in case anyone wants to know. And it's just this rope swing ladder thing. You just hang it from the ceiling. I'll probably put that in now. And I'll show you guys. They're both downstairs at the moment. They're a bit crazy. This is Bert, Mr. Confident. I I can't tell them apart like by their looks at the moment, but I can tell them apart because Bert is so much more confident. I've already like figured that out. And Ernie is at the back there. You can't really see it, it's quite dark, but I don't want to turn the light on because I don't want to freak them out. You're so speedy, Bert. <laughs> Ernie was really easy. Right, come on, you are gonna So come we on. don't lose them. You're out. Anne, um, look at me. We have a bird. Oh my goodness, he's so cute. <laughs> oh, good boy, he's away. So it's actually the next day now. I just thought I'd quickly update you guys on the day goose. Um, I do want to end this video soon because I want to get it uploaded today. So it's a bit of a stressful situation, but um, hopefully I'll get it up. So they're doing really well. As you can see, they have made a bit of a mess. I am actually going to be getting them fleece. Um, I've ordered them some fleece, so I'm going to just get one big piece and cut it to size for each of the levels. I think I've ordered them three different types. Um, so hopefully that will be alright. The Viva Vetter still hasn't come, but I'll probably show you that in my next video, maybe. Um, and I've also ordered a couple more things from Amazon. I think my mum's ordered me something from Amazon for them as well. So I'll definitely show you that in my next video. And obviously I'll update you more on them in my next video. Um, but <laughs> I just thought I'd quickly show you them again this morning. So this is Bert in the wheel. He loves the wheel so much. Um, we have been looking at ways to tell them apart. Because obviously they look exactly the same. Um, and I have found that actually Ernie, who is back in the corner. Um, Ernie's a little bit lighter. He is currently hiding. I don't know if he'll let me show you him. We have just had them out, so I don't want to mess with them too much because we just did handle them again. Um, we handled them a little bit last night and then we handled them this morning. But here's Ernie. Oh, I'm sorry, sweetie. I'm going to put this back just because he's really shy and I don't want to scare him. Um, I think he's squeaking at me. He's probably had enough of human contact for now. Bless him. <laughs> Um, I realise this is upside down, because it's supposed to be a heart, isn't it? There we go. <laughs> um, but yeah, I am very happy with them both. I love them so much already. Um, Bert is an absolute lunatic, honestly. Look at him. He's mental. <laughs> So yeah, I'm going to end today's video here, um, but I will definitely update you all again in my next video. I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you did, give it a big thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. And me and this lunatic, we'll see you in our next video. Bye!